uh, you know, talking about the Velvet Underground records and other little to no symbols. It's the eat up guitars on the records, high and hash. I didn't know that. But that's not what we sound like. <laughs> probably wouldn't have pushed ourselves as far as we did if we didn't have the support of people who we respected. Like, I mean, Charles from the Wrens uh, was like, I took guitar lessons from him and stuff, and he was always very supportive of like my writing and, and just, you know, and he recorded those demos that we did. So, I mean, we wouldn't really be, I don't think that we would have had the confidence in Mark for him because Charles. I love Meadowlands so much and Secaucus so much, like big records for me. I love the Wrens. I emailed them when I was in high school when I had like even earlier like demos that we did and I just sent them to the guitarist and Greg and he was just like, yeah man, this is really good and like I showed it to the guys and they really good. I'm like, I think he did, like, I mean, I'm pretty sure he did. But yeah, I just had to email him and be like, can I take guitar lessons from you? Because he was giving them out of his house in Brooklyn. Just went there, talked to him two or three hours at a time. Just little guitar instruction. A <laughs> little bit. More mentoring. Yeah. Definitely. Charles, Charles is a good guy. How did you raise the money to pay for the record? I, we worked. Matt, worked. Matt worked. He was a nice cream man. Not to mention, we got it done for uh, some pretty friendly discounts. Yeah, very, a, lot very, of, a lot of breaks nice cut along the way. Involved, yes. A lot of stars aligning in our favor to get this all done. Advanced? Yeah, there's 360. Like, just, you want to get out of there. 360? Yeah, like video games. Advanced. Wow. Get the fuck out of there. And play some video games. No, I'm less not interested. Right in. <laughs> no, I don't. If you weren't getting laid before, you certainly won't now.